Do you have issues with the slim pot making white noises on the TV or the computer monitors? Or it goes um, on and off, so it's flickering uh, on and off, goes into the black screen, then go back out. So you can see here it works fine for one minute or for, one, for a few seconds and then it go off again, as you can see. Now, do you have these issues? The real problem or the main problem is that your adapter is faulty. There's not much you can do about it. If you have bought a cheap version of the adapter, then you'll get these issues. So here's the adapter that I'll plug into the monitor. I also plug in the power source to have my device charged. Now, I got this one really cheap for it's around $7. And as a result, it doesn't work well at all. Um, you can't really use it if it, the screen just um, keep flicking on and off. So the main purpose of getting this uh, slim pot is so that I could uh, watch movies, but it doesn't work at all. So when buying a uh, slim pot, make sure that you buy a good quality one, even if you have to pay like 20 bucks, 30 bucks for it. The original one is around 30 dollars. So you can get the original one for around 30 to 40 dollars. It's definitely worth the price of getting an expensive one because um, getting a cheap one then you realize it doesn't work, you have to go out and buy another one. So what I did, I buy, actually I buy another one uh, at around $15. So this one here is uh, another one that I bought just to test it out. And when I buy, buy this, uh, this more expensive one actually works better. So if I just unplug this one here. So I'm going to plug in the more expensive one. So if you're getting a problem with your screen flickering, then it is most likely it's because the adapters that you've got is a cheap version and it doesn't work well at all. So make sure that you get the one that is more expensive and better quality. So here it is, as you can see when I plug this one in, um, the screen stays constant, it doesn't uh, go in and out. Uh, just, you have to make sure this uh, part here plug all the way in, because uh, if it's loose then um, you might have a problem with the screen flicking. So yeah, definitely want to go with the more expensive one and it works, it looks very similar, but um, one works better than the other. As you can see here, my screen doesn't get um, white noises, it doesn't flick, it doesn't go on and off and yeah work uh, quite flawlessly and that's it so um, i hope um, this um, gives you some idea of what uh, slim pot to get also just before i go off i uh, want to let you know that if you get that flickering and you can't return your slim pot what you can try to do is try to um, sand down this top bit here the usb so try to sand it down a little bit because uh, sometimes this one here this uh, this top it doesn't fit into the USB port, so you might want to sand it down a little bit. So if you get a little bit of sand and it goes down a little bit, it might fit uh, better into your Galaxy, into your Nexus, and it might work better. Just give that a try if you can't really return this this one to the stores. Thank you for watching this video.